I'm Priscilla, and this is Tiger News for Thursday, December 10th, 2020. Go Tigers! Tigers, I have a few important announcements for you today. Students, next Friday, December 18th, is the end of the quarter, the end of the second quarter. Please make sure you're putting in your best effort, submitting your assignments, and end your second quarter on the high note. Also next Friday, which is December 18th, is the day before our two-week winter break. Students, we will be following a minimum day schedule on that day. So again, students, we will be following a minimum day schedule on Friday, December 18th. We will show you that schedule at the beginning of next week. Next week, we'll be celebrating with our entire district a virtual spirit week, DSUSD's December Dare Days. So students, let's get in the holiday mood and show off some of our school spirit. Monday is Dare to Wear Flannel Day and Dare to Drive Through and support a local business. Grab your flannel shirts and grab a treat from a local business. Make sure to take a picture, tag it with the DSUSD hashtag, hashtag DSUSD December Dare Days. Finally, two big shout outs. First, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to all the students that are completing your iWriting assignments because you're killing it. Keep up the awesome work. And remember, if you complete your iReady assignments each week, you'll be placed into a raffle to win 50 bucks. Also, I want to give a big shout out. I'm so proud of each and every one of you for your positive attendance over the past couple of weeks. IMS had its most amazing attendance rate last week. And in fact, our attendance rate was higher than most of the other middle schools. Students, that's because of you. Keep up the great work. Keep coming to class every day, every period on time with your cameras on. Students, have a terrific Tiger Thursday. And as always, remember, Tigers roar. Class, class. Here's a look at your DSUSD December Dare Days. On Monday, dare to wear flannel and dare to drive through to support a local business. On Tuesday, dare to wear holiday from head to toe and dare to donate your time, money, or items. On Wednesday, dare to wear an ugly holiday sweater or red, white, and green and write a make-a-wish letter. On Thursday, dare to wear cold weather clothes and compliment someone and pay it forward. And on Friday, dare to wear your pajamas and tell someone what you admire most about them. Don't forget the hashtag DSUSD December Dare Days. Band students, to celebrate you and all your hard work, there will be an invitation-only concert for you and your family on Wednesday, December 16th. Please check your email for more information from Mr. Richards. 7th and 8th graders, did you miss out on last year's yearbook? We still have some available to purchase if you are still interested. You can purchase them for just $10 while supplies last. Please email Mr. Mason for your copy today. His email is in the video's description. Class, class. All of us at Tiger News would like to wish a very happy birthday to Miss Hollis and Mrs. Luna who will be celebrating this Saturday, and Miss Elaine and Mrs. Hartman, who will be celebrating this Sunday. Happy birthday, Tigers! Good morning, everyone. Time for another edition of Raffle Mania. I'm Mr. Cohagan. And I'm Mr. Mason. We'd like to announce the winners of this week's raffle. Thank you to everyone who's entered. Congratulations to... Christian T and Ashley G, you are this week's winners. Congrats. Mrs. Hartman will be reaching out to you about your gift card shortly. Congratulations. We would also like to announce one lucky winner of our staff raffle. Our winner this week is Mr. Vialta. 
thank you for reinforcing our roar values here at IMS. Mrs. Hartman will be reaching out to you as well. Congratulations, Mr. V. Well done, well done. Would also like to remind everybody that we have two raffles next week, our raffle mania for next Thursday, as well as our second quarter big ticket raffle, which costs 15 tickets. The deadline to enter those raffles is two o'clock on Wednesday. So make sure that you're entered either on the forum or Monday and Tuesday in the meetings after school. Remember, Tigers roar. I'm Jackie, and this is Just a Minute with Mr. Cohagen. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Mr. Cohagen. Mr. Cohagen, would you like to tell us a little bit about yourself? Well, this is my 14th year doing something in and around Indio Middle School. I've worked after school. I've worked in coaching. I was a long-term te uh, guest uh, teacher, and uh, this is my third year as a full-time teacher, so happy to be here. Okay. Mr. Cohagen, I'm going to ask you a little bit of Quick answer questions with one minute on the clock. Let's let's stop right there, Jackie. I think it's a good day for our viewers to get to know you. So I'm going to flip this and I'm going to ask you questions. Are you ready to answer some quick answer questions about yourself? Sure. All right, 60 seconds on the clock. We go. If you could only watch one show for the rest of your life, what would it be? Grey's Anatomy. Typical. If you were a giant mega monster, what city would you rampage? Uh, Washington, D.C. Good choice, good choice. What order do you put your socks on and shoes on? Shoe, shoe, sock, sock, or shoe, sock, shoe, sock? Or sock, shoe, sock, shoe? Uh, sock, shoe, sock, shoe. Coffee or tea? Coffee. Tea? Gosh. What is your most unusual talent? I can do this with my arm. Woohoo, weirdo. What's the best part of going to IMS? Um, the tea cherries. What's the silliest thing you've ever done in public? Um, a few years ago, I, me and my cousins were walking down a new, and I was like seven. And um, I was a sun bus was passing by, and I was saying bye like this, and then I didn't even see, and there was a pole right here, and I just went like that. <laughs> Perfect. That's so Jackie. That's so Jackie. <laughs> Thank you, Jackie. You're welcome. This has been just a minute with me. <laughs> Mr. Mason here. I would like to nominate Miss Hollis for the next TikTok challenge. Can't wait to see it, Miss Hollis. That's all the Tiger News we have for you today. Remember to be responsible, take ownership, act safely, and be respectful. For Tiger News, I'm Priscilla. Have a terrific Thursday, and remember, Tigers roar.